Now on Adjuster TV News, new technology is making Matterport even easier than ever to use. The Independent Auto Damage Appraisers Association, or IADA, announces their new IADA Appraiser Certification Program. An auto claims adjuster is needed in Wyoming and your catastrophe IA weather with Max Olson. But first, did you know that you will not be assigned claims without your adjuster license? You can get on IA firm rosters by using Adjuster Pro because Adjuster Pro makes it easy to get and maintain your required adjuster licenses. Pre-licensing, exam prep, and continuing education credits all in one place. Go to adjustertv.com slash adjusterpro now. This is Adjuster TV News. And now for the big story. Matterport for iPhone. Now, all you need is your iPhone 6 or later to experience the power of Matterport's groundbreaking 3D platform. Easily turn any space into a stunning and immersive digital model. According to Matterport, they see their mobile solution as a small space solution. That is two to three rooms, maybe a thousand square foot max. It is accurate to within 8% error if operated correctly, so it's not as high as their Pro 2 camera, which has a 99 plus percent accuracy. Matterport sees adjusters using this for daily claims documentation, as well as having policyholders use it to document rooms and damage prior to the adjuster arriving. Check it out at Matterport.com. The Independent Auto Damage Appraisers Association, or IADA, announces their new appraiser certification program. This program is the only certification with the full backing of the Independent Auto Damage Appraisers Association. Not just a certificate for completing a certain number of courses, this program judges if an appraiser has the professionalism, experience, mastery, and dedication to be counted among the most skilled appraisal professionals in the world. Three certification levels are available. At level one, the professional certification shows that an appraiser is an experienced and educated professional who is committed to excellence. Holders of the level two expert cert certification show the world that they are industry veterans ready to handle anything that the job throws at them. And finally, the level three master certification recognizes a master appraiser, which is an elite, highly skilled professional who has mastered his craft through true dedication. Applicants will submit a series of appraisals and then be reviewed and interviewed by the industry veterans on the IADA certification board. The appraisers who pass review will be added to the exclusive list of IADA certified appraisers and will be presented with a certificate denoting their new rank. There is a $25 fee to apply. To find out more, visit iada.org slash certification. Are you an auto adjuster? If so, would you like to work in a territory that often gets a large amount of hail? A licensed adjuster is needed in or near Cheyenne, Wyoming for auto, heavy equipment, specialty equipment, RVs and ATVs, and coming soon, property as well. Experience is a huge plus, however, training is available. If you live in this area or you're willing to travel to Wyoming, send your resume to candawinc at gmail.com. And now here's the IA weather with Adjuster TV weather correspondent, Max Olson. We have not had a shortage of severe weather since we last checked in. Numerous storms have hit Oklahoma, North Texas, expanding eastward into Arkansas and Missouri. On the morning of May 3rd, we had a severe storm that swept through southern Missouri into northern Arkansas. Places like Mountain Home received 2.5 to 2.75 inch hail. We saw severe damage to homes and vehicles. Siding was completely destroyed and windshields were crushed in. Looking at a national map here, we can see that Oklahoma has been the hardest hit as of this year. Almost the entire state is filled in with hail reports and we can see other hard hit areas, northern Texas, southern Missouri and northern Arkansas like we were just talking about and we've had reports of deployments happening in Oklahoma, places like Tulsa and Lawton as well as Louisiana and Shreveport. Despite the brief lull that we've had lately, it appears more severe weather is on the way starting this week once again in hard hit Oklahoma. The pattern appears to not break down whatsoever and we can expect an active period through the rest of May, with potential for large hail, tornadoes, and damaging winds, primarily in the southern and central states. Back to you, Matt. Thanks, Max. If you've got an announcement or story that you want independent adjusters to know about, get your message in front of more than 16,000 eyeballs every single month 
on Adjust Your TV News. Visit adjusttv.com news for more information.